When you're, when you're planting a small tree like this, the key thing to pay attention to is the root system, of course, because you're putting the tree into, into the ground where the roots are. The roots are the life source for the tree. They're the key for tree health. So you treat that zone with care and the chances for success are much higher. So this is the aesthetic you're kind of looking for. This is the look that you want. It is kind of a natural looking root flare working its way to soil grade. Create a little bit of a berm with your excess soil, but don't build it too high because then you're, you're kind of manipulating the tree's soil level. Remember, too low, never grow, too high, won't die. We are in San Michael's Park right now and we are planting 24 shrubs and flowering trees. We are along the Elks Run stream which flows to the Potomac River in the Chesapeake Bay and we actually are working really hard right now to reduce the amount of sediment and bacteria that are in this stream because it is actually impaired for those two pollutants. This is really a riparian planting, which has the greatest benefit to the stream. We wanted to be able to get volunteers out here and have a community event and really connect them to the stream so that they can see the effect that the trees are having on the stream. We found out about this tree planting from the, uh, it was posted on our mailboxes uh, in our subdivision. We felt that it was a great opportunity to uh, come out and you know, do a little work and uh, help out the neighborhood. Trees are beneficial to the watershed because they help reduce the sediment in the, in the water. It also helps run, uh, reduce runoff from roads and such. They um, um, take in carbon dioxide and produce oxygen and they give shelter and food for animals. I think it's a great opportunity to help the community and better our local watersheds. We have to make sure it's not too low. It's okay if it's a little too high because too low won't grow and too high won't die. We, we didn't know that this camping area was back here for the Boy Scouts, so now that we know, we can come back here and we can point out these trees to the other scouts and say, hey, we helped plant those. It's been so great that so many people have come out to help us today. I know well over 25 people have showed up today, which is really a lot of volunteers to plant 24 trees and clean up some trash that has been blowing all over the place along the park. And I'd just like to thank everybody who has come out and helped to clean up Elks Run.